Good afternoon, everyone. I uh, am very pleased to see such a, a large number of, of uh, televisions and newspapers, which reflects on the interest of, of this year of asking. This has been super. Um, the competition level is the highest ever. The beauty of this tournament is that nobody knows who's going to win. And this is just, I feel kind of badly for <laughs> my good friend Ivan. Uh, but uh, nothing is for certain, nothing is forgiven. And this is fantastic for the growth of basketball in Europe. And obviously we like to presumptuously think that uh, the best basketball is played in Europe. The competitive level, as I just mentioned, is unbelievable. And we're doing everything that we can to make sure that it continues to grow like it has grown in the, in the last few years. I've had some uh, conversations with people who have been around a long time, been around the game for a long time, and they all agree with the statement that I just made. This is the competitive life, this is the best ever. I must also congratulate my good friend Roman, who has worked, he and his team, and also Olga, who's sitting beside him, he and his team have worked exceptionally hard in order to guarantee the success of this tournament. Because the players are the protagonists, but nobody really knows, except the people that are directly involved, the amount of work that goes on behind the scenes. It's unbelievable. The thousands and thousands and thousands of details, and I mean from the smallest to the biggest. I don't know if you were just outside. What we, the people were doing now was practicing for the closing ceremony. They were here till two o'clock this morning, practicing. This was a final practice to make sure that everything runs smoothly. And attached just to that little thing, which is the closing ceremony, there are millions of details. How do we give the, the prizes? How do we do this? When the music come on? Do the cheerleaders participate? And so on and so forth. This is just to give you a small idea of what the organizational level is like. It's just unbelievable. And I have to, right here openly, on behalf of FIBA Europe, and on behalf of the whole FIBA Europe family, and on behalf of myself, because I was very closely involved, obviously. Uh, thank and congratulate my good friend Roman Rudvichuk for the fantastic work that they have done. Uh, we are looking forward to the next two games, which will be the highlight of the whole tournament. And I'm sure that everything will continue to go as smoothly as the rest of the tournament has gone. Um, I don't know what else to say. Later I can answer any questions if you have any. But uh, I, I have to say from, from my position, it's been a super successful tournament. And one person that I forgot to mention, the uh, president of Kyoto, my good friend Kyoto, the president of uh, Katowice, who's been a tremendous uh, help in making sure that this uh, venue this uh, Spode Karina be at the level that it should be um, in order to host an event as big as this. Thank you, uh, Mr. Zanoni. So now I uh, ask for a few words from Mr. Uh, um, for me, I can, I can uh, uh, talk in only just about the, the cities we visit. In Gdansk, and Kutosh, and also the uh, Katowice. And we are now heard some uh, NBA stars, and I don't heard any complaint. And in this case, I'm sure it was perfect as organization. There is nothing to talk about this. Our team, unfortunately, finished with eight victories, and only just one defeat, and finished fifth. <laughs> it's not completely. Uh, seem very good, but we sent to FIBA in the next 
next day, certainly new organization and new ideas for your attention to change in the future. But here in Poland, it was exactly like in France in 1999, 10 years ago, organized in seven cities. And it was also a, a great face for all the country, and it's a very important thing. And uh, I want to say thank you to all the organizers and the volunteers. They are very warm, and there is always a very good connection with us, and there is no problem about this. And I am very proud, proud about the organization of the Polish uh, Federation. Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, now I uh, ask for uh, words about your last for our president of our Federation, Roman Lubiczuk. Pozwolicie Państwo, że mówię po polsku. Chcę tylko podziękować za te słowa wyrażone przez Pana Sekretarza Generalnego i przez Pana Prezydenta Francuskiej Federacji. Myślę, że zorganizowaliśmy te mistrzostwa na odpowiednim poziomie. Opinie mamy, jeżeli chodzi o organizację, bardzo dobrą. W związku z powyższym myślę, że tyle, tyle co mogę powiedzieć. Czas na ocenę naszych mistrzostw, w każdym względu z postępem organizacyjnym, myślę, że nastąpi w ciągu dwóch tygodni. Czas na podziękowanie setkom tysiącom ludzi, miastom, które naprawdę wykonały świetną robotę. Nie chciałbym dzisiaj nikomu dziękować, mam jeszcze kilka godzin naszych mistrzostw, więc odpukać, żeby się nic nie wydarzyło. Myślę, że za dwa tygodnie będziemy w stanie Państwu o wszystkim opowiedzieć. Dziękuję. Mr. Lubiczuk, Mr. 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 Mr.